Good morning, everybody. I'm really excited to share this new uh, letter with you today, Samit. But before we get into that, I'd like to share with you, Hiberto, my beautiful hey, assistant. I'm here for you and you are for me. Oh, wonderful. We'd like yes. to share um, some of our Hebrew letter uh, etudes. We call them etudes, little little etudes, little meditations. Um, and you can see how we do it. And then when you're creating your own movements for Samech, um, you can see sort of how we start with a base and then the letter sort of grows like a tree out of the base. So let's all stand up just where you are in your home, in your place. You don't have to be anything different than who you are right now. <sighs> yeah, and let's start with the Aleph. I always love start. Good morning, Lenny. I see you, Lenny. I see you, Susan. Yeah. And let me um, switch to my music so it sounds really good. Uh, There's a lot to do on Zoom. And we'll begin with a, a piece of music I love by Daniel Wapless and Flavio Lopez called Ain Sof. There you go, Ain Sof. <laughs> Okay, here we go. If you just walk around your place, I, yeah, I'd like you to walk around your space. See how much space you can push through right now. And breathing and coming into your body, coming into your home, exactly where you are exactly who you are. And as you're walking around your space, I'm going to ask you to find a place you feel good. You may like the light. You may like the texture of the floor. And I want you to take your stand, take your stand there, plant yourself, root yourself in that one place, and just come into that first dance, that breath of life, Ruach Hashem, the breath of life, that first dance of the chest rising and falling, rising and falling. Just that. Just that's enough. We're going to build our arc of ecstasy today, but let's just start small and, and inside yourself. spotlight myself and Hilberto and we'll, we'll take you through the first etude of Aleph, the letter of mastery of the lower and higher waters, your lower waters and your higher water and your practice, the Torah, whatever your Torah is that connects you to your lower and your higher to realize that we're all one, it's all one, not separate. Here we go.
show you Tzamech now. Tzamech. And then you'll get to Tzamech yourself. I'll show you my little pose. Now keep moving. I'm gonna take you through some gaga. Keep moving. Even if it's very small, even if it's just very subtle and delicate, start to move the spaces inside your body. What does it feel like to move inside the space of your body? without any care of how it looks or the impression you're making at all. Breathing and dancing the space inside. So Gaga is all about your own internal pleasure. Gaga is about finding joy inside the very delicate, the very, even just like a, a flicker of finger. As long as it feels authentic to you and gives you joy. Okay, so we'll start with flowing. Remember the flowing. Um, <clears throat> let me get you just some... Good music here. Yes, yes, yes. You all know that I love Yemen blues. And we'll try, we'll try this one. Here we go. Here we go. Now, floating oh, is the idea of floating bone. You're floating in some sort of beautiful substance of ocean. I love to think of the Mediterranean so warm and blue. So small, so delicate. Pleasure. How much slower and enjoyable can you make it? Yeah. Breathing. Always breathing. See if you can partner with your breath on these 
delicate, subtle, pleasurable moves that are coming from you. On peut pas quitter do do que moi chérie. Que sentir on dit de moi. Now, can you really ground, root that sacrum, that sacrum, that place, again, like I say, between your Gentiles and your Holy of Holies. Ground it, suck in this energy of the earth, suck it in, suck it in, suck it in from the earth, go down to the earth. This is where Yemenite dance exists. This is where a lot of dances exist. And just almost as if you are have a, have a paintbrush on your sacrum, painting circles and circles and figure eights with your sacrum. Yes, I see it. Enjoy that area. It's not, we don't get to do that too much in American culture. This is deep from the North Africa, from Africa, from the Middle East. You have to get a little bit more in plie, a little bit more bended knee to get this. Come down to the earth. Beautiful. Now I'm wondering if you can add your elbows, slow circles in the air with your elbow. like you're painting circles with your chin, circling chin, circling elbows, circling sacrum. I challenge you to go slower. I challenge you just to go slower. I'm wondering if you can imagine as you're circling and sphering and figure eighting every part of your body. Oh, oh yeah, I'm sorry, I forgot the feet. Can you circle and massage all over your feet? Let them dig into the floor, massage them, circle them. Gaga calls it dancing outside your feet. zone keep in the zone keep moving even though there's no music keep moving I'm wondering if now you can express the music the feeling of the music in the soles of your feet just let the soles of the feet express the emotion here we go <laughs>
and breathing and moving. And breathing and moving. Now I'm wondering if, let me give you a couple other images. Can you imagine as you're building on top of one idea after the other? Can you allow your arms to float out, out, out of their sockets, out, almost as if you just want to embrace the world, but they're, the arms are extending out and almost leaving their, their sockets. Café. Mm -hmm. 